What's up guys, Manny from itech 224 talking about some of the new rumors of the iPad mini. There have been more and more pictures of the supposed iPad mini leaking and really it seems like this is becoming a reality. Today we actually heard the rumor that they are actually already in production of the iPad mini. If that's true, then that means the iPad mini is going to be here and it's going to be here really soon. It's said to be a 7.8 inch screen, which is gonna put it right in that category of the Nexus 7 and the Kindle Fire. Before I actually owned the Nexus 7, I thought the idea of a seven inch tablet was completely dumb. I thought there was no reason at all to have one. But after owning my Nexus 7, I have to say that it is a great form factor. Now for me, I don't do any serious work on this. I just find the screen way too small to actually get things done. But as for a media consumption device, this is perfect. I could fit this comfortably in one hand, use it for a long time, and I never really get Get tired. I never really thought I got tired with the iPad before, but after using this and going back to the iPad, you could definitely feel a strain on your hand. So that really has convinced me of the 7 inch form factor. It's something that I think a lot of people will enjoy. It's definitely something that a lot of people want. And if Apple makes one, then it's definitely going to be a big hit like everything Apple does. Now the big question is where will this fit in in their product line considering the price point? They just announced the new fifth generation iPod and that starts out at $200. Now keep in mind that the Nexus 7 actually starts at $200 as well. And the new iPad starts at $499. So it's gonna have to be between the $250 range to the $400 range for it to even be an option. What consumers really want is a low cost option. If that didn't matter, then they would just buy the iPad. There's no reason for them to want something cheaper. If the seven inch tablet started at $299, that would be a great price point because people would want it because they're getting an iPad but it's not at such a high price. So if these rumors are true we are looking at a announcement in October and a release in November. That's going to be in perfect time for the holiday season. So what do you guys think about the iPad mini? Do you think it's real? Do you think it's something that you would want? Or do you think it's dumb going to the seven inch route and you want your 10 inch tablet? At first I thought it was kind of dumb. I didn't really think there was a reason for it, but after thinking about some things I could actually use it for, I think it's really cool and plan on getting one if it is announced. The main thing I really want this for is to be able to use it as a home theater remote. You can do that on the iPad, you could do that on the Nexus 7, but in all honesty, the Nexus 7 just doesn't have that kind of elegance that I enjoy in my products. That's the main reason why I love Apple products. It just works with the kind of stuff that I like. It just works the way I want it to. Android is great, don't get me wrong. I love it, I use it all the time, like I said, but it's just not exactly what I want. And the iPad is just too big. It's just not the right form factor for a remote. I think the seven inch form factor would work perfectly. So that's just one thing I think is really cool to use a seven inch tablet for. Of course, that's just a really small thing. Not many people would do that, but for me, that's really cool. Anyway guys, that's it for this video. Let me know what you guys think about these rumors in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you guys subscribe and give it a thumbs up, that would be awesome. Hope you enjoyed this video. Again, my name is Matt from iTech224, and I'll see you guys in my next one. See ya.